Hey Arizona, it is starting to heat up and you know what that means. We're gonna be running our air conditioning units non-stop. This is Joel Harris, he's the owner of Sterling Services and he's here to help us with those to basically save some money on those costly right, AC repairs right. by giving us some important preventative maintenance that we should be doing. Good to see you. I would love to. Thank you. You say it really starts great. with the thermostat. It does. Um, this particular thermostat is, uh, this is a problem preventer, that's for sure, just in and of itself, because this thing will um, literally notify you if there's a problem with the system. You can control it uh, when you're at work, on your way home from work, that a homeowner goes through uh, that preventative maintenance. What should we be looking for? Well, for one thing, preventive maintenance. And the now, Arizona Heat Pump Council has a uh, special going on right now. And they do this 20 point cooling system check sheet where we go through every single one of these items and make sure that everything is up to par. So, how long do you recommend we get this done? This should be done every spring this Every cooling ch checklist and it's a good idea to do a heating one as well for safety purposes if you have an attic system this is probably how it looks unfortunately um, insulation on the duct work has just deteriorated and it's literally falling off right now efficiency issue there's a lot of heat gain happening here cold air is blowing through this and it's running through an attic, which can be 140 degrees. Okay. So it's gaining heat before it gets to you. What kind of money are we talking about? If we are running our system with, you know, items that are decayed and not working properly, are we, we're losing money inevitably Absolutely. on our bill. Absolutely. Something as simple as a component like this, capacitor, this happens to be measuring only about a third of what it's rated at. This makes your current draw go up a lot higher and in essence that relates directly to an increase in electric usage okay so uh tune up one of these uh checklist maintenance pays for itself easily yeah, for sure. i do do some uh, uh, light training on how to wash these out occasionally so which is a whole process of, okay. of of first disconnecting um the electric power to make sure that it's it's nice and safe, and then and then hosing out the the condenser all the way How around. How long is that hosing and, and, and spraying that off? Very 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 much so, very much so. That keeps the operating pressures lower, okay. and if you keep the operating pressures lower, the compressor doesn't work as hard.